If you want to change the default folder color for your Mac, the first thing we need to do is click on the Apple logo in the top left hand corner and in the drop down menu we're going to select system settings. Once you're inside system settings you want to click on appearance in the left hand side menu and once you're inside there you want to find the folder color option and in the drop down menu you can change it to whatever color you'd like. Now for example if we bring up the finder, here we can get a preview of what the folder colors will look like. So if I select red for example, here you'll see that it will update in real time and again this is going to change system wide. You can also choose a custom color, so again if you click in the drop down menu and click on choose color, here we can choose from any color on the color spectrum as well as changing the opacity level. So once you're happy with your selection you want to exit out of it and now you can go ahead and enjoy your custom folder colors for the entirety of your Mac. You can also customize individual folders, so to do this we're first going to open the finder and we're going to select the folder that we want to customize. Once we've done this we're going to control click and in the context menu we're going to select customize folder and then you'll see this customization menu. Now just like before you can change the color of the folder, so for example I'm going to select red. Just bear in mind that when you change the color of the folder from this menu it's also going to tag it with that color which you can use to search for later. So you can also select multiple tags. You can also add an emoji to that folder as well. So you can either choose from a list of all of these emojis here. So for example, I'm going to select this one. Or alternatively, you can select a traditional emoji. And to do that, you want to select emoji at the bottom. And then again, just like any other emoji icon, you can just select it and add it to the folder, just like that. And if you're not happy with the folder color or tags, you simply want to deselect them from this menu. And you can also remove the emoji by clicking the clear menu at the top. So once you're ready, you can exit out of the customization folder. And then you can go ahead and start using your Mac just as you normally would.